Thank you. Back to school. Kids will soon be walking or biking to school or the bus stop. And Catherine's here to tell us about some Green Bay parents on the east side. They're concerned about their kids' safety on the streets. Yeah, Tammy, I talked to a couple of moms. They say the speed limit in their neighborhood is 25 miles an hour, but they say cars go a lot faster than that. Let me show you. It's a three-way intersection. We're talking about Sherry and Edward. It's on the east side. It's roughly between Edison Middle School and I-43. There's no stop sign. Some moms who live there say they are worried that when school starts again, their kids waiting for the bus could be at risk. They say drivers often go through the area at least 10 miles an hour over the speed limit. I would say slow down, watch for kids, especially with school year coming up, like always have it in the back of your mind. Don't text and drive. Don't just put your phone down. It's not worth it. So those moms took action. They contacted their local alderman and I talked with him in District 2 of Green Bay. He told me he consulted with Green Bay City officials and police and they have now put a speed radar sign in that neighborhood. Police say the sign will be out for about a week. Then they'll analyze the data they collect. And we're going to keep talking about back to school and keeping your kids safe coming up in our six o'clock half hour. Find out about a tool parents can use to see which intersections in their area have had the most crashes.